down. Hi, this is Mike from 3D Concrete. We're out here at Ace Hardware, um, located in Waukesha, Wisconsin. Uh, we're going to be doing an engraving right here on the front stoop. Um, right down in the main drag. Uh, going to catch a lot of attention. We're going to be doing an Ace Hardware um, 3 feet or 39 inches by 24 inches uh, right on the front stoop here. Okay, we're uh, back with you. Basically, we took the, ve the machine out of the vehicle, uh, set it where it's supposed to go, uh, measured about 10 inches off the door on both sides to get it straight. And then what you do is one of the most crucial parts is to level the machine. Uh, you get something that's too low all the way across, you kind of raise and lower these until it's nice and tight like that. It's going to find your happy medium base. You do that to both sides. Uh, you got your four screw um, adjusting it right there. Slide this in. It's already pretty good. Concrete's not very level, um, as, as expected. You just gotta find the best portion of it. Um, after we lower the screws um, to get a level, we go ahead and move the head into the center of the project because that's our starting point. Um, so we're gonna move the head to the center of the project, zero everything out and go ahead and start. Um, right now we're doing actually our third pass. Uh, turns out we're probably doing the worst case scenario of concrete. It's on a slope. Um, there's bubbles and waves everywhere. All you do is basically do another pass, do another pass. You can set up the program so it just takes out a sliver every time. And you keep doing that until everything is pretty much in green. Um, right now, you see the E is the last one. Um, we'll pretty much reset the whole program just to do the E. We can take the A's and all the hardware except for the E out and we do the E. Um, other than that, all the letters should be pretty good. Uh, the back of the casting is not attached right now, so you see some dust. Um, no big deal. Alright, this shot is showing the original profile pass of the Ace. Uh, it is the first pass. You are going to have some areas that aren't um, engraved. The second shot is of our second pass and we are able to show the entire profile um, evenly. This uh, last shot or this video is of the hardware part of the engraving. Um, it's a good example of how unlevel the concrete is. Um, obviously the situation we are in where whenever they poured it some 35 years ago it wasn't able to be striked off so it was probably hand troweled showing the different um, bubbles or waves in the concrete. We were still able to do quite a nice engraving. This here we're doing um, just kind of like a reveal yeah, it gives us an idea, make sure we hit all the areas, everything's engraved nice and evenly. Um, from there, uh, we would make sure that all the the project is showing so that at that point we can move the machine and uh, begin vacuuming the entire area. Um, the next couple shots are going to show the before and afters. Uh, hopefully this whole video showed how easy it was. Um, Obviously, the more you do it, the better you're going to get at it, but it's basically pretty simple uh, start to finish. Hope you enjoyed the video.